Some NBA action for you coming up. I'm Kevin Harlan, along with Stan Van Gundy and Greg Anthony. On the sidelines, it's David Aldridge. You'll see the Golden State Warriors facing the Cleveland Cavaliers. Now, here is Irving. To the right side. Love with a wide-open look. A three-pointer off the mark. And even without that three ball dropping for him, the defense should have done more on that last play. Basket counts. Great work inside by Curry there. So clever and composed in the paint. And with an update from the sidelines, let's check in with David Aldridge. Well, a bit ago, Teron Lou and I were able to chat. Now I talked to him about the challenge of trying to stop Kevin Durant. Coach said it's about not letting him get into a rhythm. I told the guys they need to focus on staying in front of him and trying to contest everything. Easier said than done, but we'll see if they can even make things difficult for KD. Guys? Okay, David, much appreciated. Now, here is Irving. After the miss from Clay Thompson. Pass to Thompson. Out to Smith. The Trey. Offensive rebound. Cleveland moving it around. And Love has it in the corner. It's stolen by Curry. And it's the Warriors on the break. A shot by Thompson, and no one's around. Good, and it's Green picking up the assist. Arguably the smoothest jumper in the game. Clay Thompson. No one near Smith as he lets it go. Kicks it out to James. Pass to Irving. Just five to shoot. Love outside. Cleveland keeps it going. A new 14-second shot clock. Nice shot by Thompson. And this is what Thompson does best. His aggressiveness on the boards is what makes him a valuable player. And here comes Smith leading the fast break. Pass to James. Now Thompson. A second chance effort. LeBron James on the win. In the corner, Smith with it. Sinks the triple. Such a reflexive shooter. Smith rarely needs any time to get set up and fire. Outside for KD. One-on-one -on -one fast break. And it's blocked. in his first shot this game and, and we're so used to seeing KD light it up from outside found great positioning and then delivers and Teron Liu calls timeout he wants to make some adjustments to the game plan clearly about three minutes into this first quarter. Irving looking over the floor. Pass to LeBron. Love outside. Here's James. That's in there. Love with the assist. A monster down low. LeBron James, the rare package of skill, size, and athleticism. Thompson for three. Thompson with the rebound. Cavaliers leading. And here in the first quarter, with a little over three and a half minutes played, outside Irving. like the illegal kick was set. Yep, that's right. That'll get their attention. Beyond the leaning, you could see his feet more set on that screen. Easy call. 
look, you can get away with a lot in terms of screens today. But you can't make it that obvious. Now, here's Curry. Right side, Kevin Durant. Off target with his three. Here's Irving. One fifty-two left here in the first quarter. Here's James. Buries it down low. James has got six. And nice touch from the inside. I, I'm a fan of when LeBron just burrows his way inside and takes it back. Now here's Thompson. Pass to Curry. One twenty-seven left here in the opening quarter. Good D from Love. Doesn't register as a block, but he did everything you want defending that shot. Well, you know, sometimes the most pivotal plays don't always go on the stat sheet. And Jefferson wide open. He shoots. Good, and the assist goes to LeBron. Finding a little rhythm here that they have to like where they're at. Yeah, you're seeing their offense in a flow. Now it's time for their defense to turn up the heat a little bit. 105 left to play in the first. It's Curry outside. It's holding by Fry. And you could tell he thought that triple was going to fall. And there's the call on Curry. That is his first foul of the game. Cleveland leading by seven. Outside Irving. Forty-three seconds left in the first quarter. On the wing, Irving. Shot clock at five. Fires from deep. And on defense, Curry's quickness really pays off. Able to stay all over the shooter. Durant just inside the line. And he can't stop this drought. Another miss. Outside Irving. Traps in the tray. Yeah, we're seeing some fireworks from them already. Yeah, I mean, this is exactly how you want to start a game with a big offensive push. Curry can't get it to go. And so it's Cleveland with a 10-point lead. Some breathing room heading into the break. And they've done a phenomenal job down low. So many of their points coming right at the rim. We'll get you back to the action. And glad to have you with us, folks. Second quarter of basketball. This game has not exactly been neck and neck, but plenty of time left in this one. And a closer look here at the scoring breakdown for Cleveland. Well, the coaching staff's game plan is very clear. Move the ball on the perimeter and shoot the shots with no hesitation. Here's McCray. Cleveland needs to get a shot off here. It's Fry. It's off the key. Off the mark there with the three-point shot. Well, the defense catches a break there. You expect him to make those. Playing with high energy, outworking the defense up the floor. Yeah, the commitment to run is paying great dividends on the break. Jones, no luck. Warriors trailed by six. Knocks it loose. Pass to Barnes. And it's good assisting on the play with Livingston. Barnes has got four points in the quarter. Well, you love the unselfishness, makes the next pass, and enables his team to capitalize on the possession. Williams gets the bucket. Here's Livingston. And here's Barnes for three. It's holding by Fry. Pass to Jefferson. Outside Williams. For three, it's rebounded by Livingston. On the wing, Barnes. Thompson hammers it down. 
an impressive athlete. I like seeing Thompson take it inside and drop the hammer. And the timeout called here by Teron Liu. Looking for a breather and maybe just one or two things to talk about. Cleveland leading by four. And we're about two minutes into the second quarter here. And Jones has it in the corner. Knocks down the three ball. Jones has got his first three points of the game. Well, the defense gave that away. He's a skilled shooter who you have to contest that ball. Curry gets it to go inside and they've repeatedly probed inside in the first half, guys, and, and it's paid off. Perfect. Count it. His second make in four attempts. A defender has Irving closely covered, but he's just so determined to get through the contact and to the bucket. And the wide-open shot from Green. Kept alive. Shoots the three. Here's Pachulia. And at last, they get one to fall. Really strong rebounding on the interior, and he gets the easy put back. Here's Irving. And the rebound goes to the Warriors. Here in the second quarter, about three minutes played. The shot by Thompson, no good. And it's Irving with the ball for the Cleveland Cavaliers. They've led by as much as 10. Back to Thompson. Six to shoot. Inside. Here's Jones. And just tacks a few more points onto their lead with the tomahawk. Ah, that's bringing it down hard. And we've got a timeout called by Steve Kerr. This will give him a chance to discuss some potential alterations. Cavaliers making a switch here. Warriors trailed by seven. Thompson outside, and stolen by James. LeBron, oh, we have big move by LeBron. And what an explosive finisher LeBron is, rocking the rim whenever he goes up like that. Durant deciding where to go with it. Outside for Curry. And again, it's the Warriors missing. Cleveland leading by nine. Two, 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 two. Irving from long range. Buries it from three-point range. Irving's got five points now in the quarter. You could just see the passion and love with which he plays the game. You see how he prepares, the work ethic, the way he interacts with his teammates. And when he hits the floor, it's all about the game. Time now to turn to our sideline reporter, David Aldridge. David. Kevin, the league recalibrated its emphasis on fouling during last season. Commissioner Adam Silver said there was a sense that offensive players had too much of an advantage. So an adjustment was made. The fans want great offense, but they want players to be allowed to play defense as well. I think that's what we're seeing. Kevin, it's a welcome change. Welcome indeed. No doubt about it, D.A. And so Steve Kerr calls for the timeout. He wants a minute here to get things straightened out with his team. Warriors trailed by 12. Here's Curry. Here he goes. Banked in off the glass. Curry's got six points. I mean, he is so lethal on the drive. Once Curry knifes inside, there's little you can do to stop him. Offensive rebound. Out to Smith. Left side, Irving. And there's the call on Curry. Stephen Curry. That's foul number two for him. First team foul. Fifty-four seconds left in the second quarter. The screen from Thompson. Down to five on the shot clock. Pass to James. And I love what Thompson provides at the defensive end. He is smart and tough. And two free throws coming up, unable to get that one to go with all the content. The Warriors shooting their initial free throws of the game right here. 
That's good from Stephen Curry. And he makes both free throws. Yeah, great effort tonight, and he's been rewarded with trips to the line. Here's Irving. Good, and the assist goes to James. Ten points for Kyrie Irving. Almost effortless looking. Kyrie's motion inside is so well practiced. Four seconds separating the shot and game clocks. Back to Curry. A three. A three ball from Curry. Well, when you have a scorer as skilled as he is, you do everything you can to get him the looks he needs. Pass to Irving. And it is good! And the buzzer! Wow! And give him credit. Good awareness of the time remaining. Yeah, really a perfect way to finish that quarter on a strong, positive note. And we hope you've enjoyed the broadcast so far. We're halfway through the game. And he gets the basket. Officials blowing the whistle, so a chance at the line for one more. On the offensive end, Curry both prolific and efficient. On the night, he's gone two for two at the stripe. First team foul. LeBron, left side. Releases, and it's KD with the rebound. Warriors trailed by six. It's Curry with the drive. He scores a six bucket from the floor with that one. He's shot the ball 11 times. And here's Smith. On the wing, Irving. From downtown, it's good, and it's his sixth make against 11 attempts. Some of the fastest hands in the league right now. Kyrie knowing he has to get rid of it. Terrific play call to give him a clean look at the rim. That's how you want to start the second half. Yeah, I like how they're establishing their interior presence right away. That's going to collapse the defense and create other opportunities. And when he's on like this, guys, there's not much you can do to stop Kyrie. An incredible shot maker. For three, Durant. And Irving pulls it down. And it's Irving with the ball for the Cavaliers. They've held a 12-point lead early. LeBron outside. Outside Irving. Pulls up on the way. And they turn over the 24-second buzzer, signaling the shot clock violation. And so Steve Kerr calls for the timeout. And coach has decided they need a moment to talk things over. Several teams changing it up here. Warriors trailed by seven. McGee with it. Hasn't made one yet. Here's James. Shooting foul as the whistle blows. He'll shoot two free throws. First personal foul. That one on Thompson. And such a physical player inside. LeBron doesn't fear contact on the way up. And James drills them both. And it's the Warriors with the ball. And it's West in the corner. Barnes outside. And again, it's the Warriors missing. And here's James outside. And the rebound goes to the Warriors. On the wing, Thompson. For the three. Thompson with the three! And Thompson thrives in those catch-and-shoot situations. Not quite two and a half minutes played here in the second half. And David West gets the whistle that time. That is his first foul of the game. And it's out of bounds. The Cavalier is able to retain possession here. And he jumped out to that ball immediately. Great reaction on that deflection. Yeah, and you know they're tracking the tips and deflections because that tells you who's affecting the game. 
Here's LeBron. And it's blocked by McGee. And they'll get another chance. Pass to Fry. Back to LeBron. This one for three. Gets it to drop, and now he's shooting at a five for eight clip. Showing some range. LeBron more than capable of hurting you from deep. On the wing, Barnes. Thompson outside. Takes the three. Basket is good. The assist from Barnes. Thompson's got 11. Both teams running perimeter-oriented plays that are working. Well, you know it's become a three-point shooting league. Teams shooting a steady diet from outside. And here's James outside. Thompson with the rebound. Warriors trail by six. Pass to West. Thompson outside. Here's Livingston. Misses the three, and he used the pump fake well there, but he couldn't capitalize. Here's James. Oh, LeBron's just too strong inside. Well, you can see why he's a go-to guy for them. They trust in his ability to shoulder the offensive load. Takes it inside. Now, that's what I call a momentum changer. Yeah, when you've got a point guard, that kind of spring, no lead is safe. Yeah, he saw the opportunity to finish with some authority, trying to fire his guys up. Love outside. Pass to James. Lock at six. They set the screen. Scores the bucket. He's seven for 11 and continues to look good. No question, James, is the green light from anywhere. That, that mid-range is just another area where he's dangerous. Important points there. Got him on a nice play, getting the ball inside and right to the bucket. In the corner, Smith with it. And it's good, assisting on the play. was got a little bit over. He's got six. And the main role of Smith... Knock down those threes. Force opponents to expand their defense. Right there, the defender clearly trying to inhibit a fast break. I think that's a transition take foul. And a chance for just a second to check out the scoring breakdown for the Cavaliers. Well, they've really been sharing the basketball. All coaches talk about that, try to get their teams to do it. It's really great when you see it in action. Cleveland leading by nine. It's stolen by Curry. Let's the three fly. It's rebounded by Jefferson. On its way from Irving for two. And the rebound goes to the Warriors. We've got a nine second difference between the shot clock and the game clock. Durant wide open. He fires. And he's good on the three ball. KD's got five now. Man, that's a scary sight for the defense. The last thing you want is for Durant to find his rhythm from downtown. Here's McCray. Cleveland gets it back. The kick out to Irving. Another shot. And good that time. And that's now 19 points for Kyrie Irving. Upside Curry. No good from 18. Not sure what, what the D was doing there. Clearly a breakdown. You can ill afford to give a guy like him that good a look. And so it's Cleveland holding up. The fourth quarter has arrived. So good to have you with us. The Cavaliers leading by eight. Now Irving. Plays it up and banks it in. Irving's got nine points now in just the second half. Well, this is what you're trying to do. Put the game away. Yeah, but you can't let up now. We've seen too many wild comebacks in this league. And that one misses. Well, probably a little draft in the arena tonight. He's the last guy you expect to miss the mark by that. Absolutely. 
and it's Irving with the ball for the Cavaliers. Yes, that goes in. Irving's got 23. You can't let Irving get comfortable in that pick and roll. Superb at knowing when to shoot in those situations. Durant's shot is good. And coming down the stretch here, both teams still on fire. Yeah, in hopes that your opponent is just going to go cold, that's not going to happen. It doesn't look like in this one. This might go down to whoever has the last possession. And they get it back again. I mean, how many rebounds offensively have they had? Everything's going right for them today. Over in the corner, Pachulia. Outside Durant. Muscling it in, Kevin Durant. Not taking the hit there, Durant. So hard to stop. And the timeout called here by Teron Liu. He knows every possession is critical now. So it's both teams making substitutions here. And let's head over to the sideline and catch up with David Alder. Hey, Kevin, during that last break, I heard Teron Lewis he talk to the team. He reminded his team, we're up. All the pressure is on them. Let's just keep playing our game. Makes sense because they've got a nice lead late in this game. Back to you guys. Thank you, David. The basket counts and one. They'll go to the line with a chance to make it a three-point play. Inspiring display of imagination. Irving simply creates ways to finish. And the ball out of play. The Warriors will inbound. Warriors trail by 10. Here's Curry. A shot. No good. Pass to James. Smith for three. Yes, and it's LeBron picking up the assist. Smith's got the lead up to 13 now for the Cavs. And Smith loves pulling up from three. Never scared to fire when he's out beyond. Yeah, this is when they need to lean on him more. Get him the ball and let him build some momentum. LeBron has doubled. Love high post. Out to Thompson. Cleveland moving the ball around. Shot clock at six. Irving up top. And the rebound goes to the Warriors. You can hear him sputtering all the way over here. He knows he should have knocked that one down. For three, Durant. Thompson with the rebound. Cleveland leading by 11. It's stolen by Green. Looney makes it off the glass. Just a late reaction there from the defense, and he is always going to finish that one. Pass to Thompson. Love outside. Gets it to go from beyond the arc. Love's got himself on the board with three there. And there aren't many big men who've been more comfortable on a catch-and-shoot jumper than Love. He's very polished in that situation. And we've got a timeout called by Steve Kerr. There was no hesitator. He wants to talk to the team right now. Here's Curry. Good D by Thompson. And even three on three break. Irving with the ball. Out guarded by Pachulia. Love outside. Yes, and it's Irving picking up the assist. Love's got six points in the quarter. Heavy incoming from beyond the arc. A key part of their initiative this entire fourth quarter. Yeah, it's always a little risky to lean this hard on the three-point shot. But when you're knocking him down, you might as well keep riding it. And it's Irving missing. Warriors trailed by 15. Steph Curry, what a finish! 
Yeah, yeah, and you see how Steph altered his pace there. Sometimes it looks like he isn't moving at all, and then bam, he goes warp speed. And when you're trying to cut into a lead, you can ill afford mistakes like that. Yeah, that's just a lack of focus. Plays like that can really frustrate a coaching staff. The Cavaliers leading by 13. The kick out to Irving. Back to Jefferson. Thompson outside. And it's a defensive three-second violation. And the technical free throw is good. The feel LeBron has for the game, unreal. Whatever situation he finds himself in, he always seems to have an answer. To the middle, Jefferson. Jefferson. And he converts the layup. Man, just adding insult to injury. He just waltzes inside and extends this lead. Well, it's not going to get any easier if they can't improve their defensive intensity. They got to show some fight. And he knew what he was going to do before the ball even got to him. Katie is always ready to let it fly. Kicks it out to James. Now, here is Smith. Back to LeBron. A three ball. Yes, and it's Smith with the assist that time. LeBron's got 13 points in the second half. On the wing, Thompson. Tried to come right back with a three of his own, but it's no good. The Cavaliers leading by 16, and now they decide to foul intentional. And you can see where they're coming from by fouling to stop the clock, but really they're just kidding themselves. Out to the right wing. Outside Irving. In the corner, Smith with it. Thompson outside. Pass to Irving. Fires the three. Another three for Cleveland. Inspired tonight. They fought hard and at crucial points just made the plays. Yeah, they saved their best basketball for this home stretch, and they certainly earned this one. LeBron outside. From the baseline. And the call.